Today I'm going to show you how to create a customized setup sheet for Autodesk Power Mill of your own. For this, I'm going to open a Microsoft Word document here. In this, I created my own as, a, as I wish. I have a table and uh, had given the project picture to be placed here. So I had given a big table and the next in the next one I'm uh, giving my parameter as my name and that particular parameter can be called using these commands these commands are available in your power mill where you can find under help go to documentation under parameters you can find setup sheet summary if you come down here you can find these uh, commands so which can be extracted through as a HTML document so for example if you would like to uh, need to present your cutting feed at your uh, setup sheet you can get this particular uh, command and copy it in your word document here so for example uh, if you paste uh, the last column i'm going to change for this so i put feed and if you say your command here as cut similar from your power mill as cut here so now i'm going to save this document first and uh, I'll also save as I'm going to save this in particular location on the desktop as HTML format I'm going to give some some other name so now um, you have to edit again that particular uh, plus page here we are going to to add some more commands if you go down here you can find your uh, the parameter name if you see in your uh, Microsoft Word you had input a value called feed at your last column so find feed there okay from the next one now you are going to run that particular parameter so what you have to do is um, this give you a single row only so what you have to do is if you have a multiple rows multiple toolpaths it have to be produced that multiple output so what I'm going to do is here just I'm open my previous document and uh, input a HTML command called summary open copy this and paste it just before your uh, command is getting start so I'm going to paste this one here at the same time I need to close that summary so by copy here and paste it after this TR and save this file so now what you have to do is come back to your NC program and uh, go to the paths, browse that page and uh, now you can see the preview. Now you can get the output of that particular one. So to path name, tool type, diameter, tip radius, depth, stock time as well as you can have your own parameter likewise which can be find in your power mill documentation page under setup sheet and customize it also you can print from here thank you